you know who is also locked in on the game? NBA G League champion, head coach of the Delaware Blue Coats, Kobe Carl is mic'd up. Kobe, you got us? I got you. What's up, brother? Congratulations on winning the championship. I know you're coaching the Team Hines right now. This game's been back and forth. What's the key here now in the fourth quarter? Well, I think we got to set ourselves down a little bit. Um, everyone's playing hard, but we got to organize ourselves a little better. We got to find a way to get some stops. Um, I just told them in the timeout, communication in these situations is really important just because we haven't been together. So figuring out how to run um, and, and, and playing together. Kobe, this is Corey Alexander. We got a chance to talk pregame, and you were so excited to talk to us simply because when we're on your games, you win. So that means that they're going to have to come away with the win here tonight simply because, you know, we're here, me and Shrip, talking to you, right? Well, if that's the way it works, then <laughs> yes, I'm, I'm happy for that. Yeah. Well, tell me a little bit about this experience for you here in the combine. Of course, you've been here as a player, I believe, but now here coaching in this scenario. Has it been a, a different scenario, I'm sure, the way that you looked at it? Yeah, it's, uh, I was just talking before the game with a couple of people. It, it's fun for me because I've been in their shoes. Um, I've, I've felt their anxiety. You know, I've been, I've been on this court before, and it's not easy, right? You, you, you put in a lot of work to get here, and then you get two or three days to show it, right? And then if you don't play well one day, you start pressing the next day. So, um, our, you know, our job as coaches is to try to settle them down, organize them a little bit, and then put them in positions to be successful. And uh, so in front of me, we, we did not do that. Kobe LaFonso Ellis, I, I know Ben Shepard just turned the basketball over right in front of you there, but he's been impressive today. What's been the most in, impressive attribute of his as you spent time with him the last couple of days? Who is that, Ben? Ben Shepard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think he plays with great energy. You know, I, I saw that in the four on four. He, you know, he, he has a great spirit to him, uh, communicates, uh, plays really hard. Um, and I think you can tell with those guys, they, they influence others on, in your group, and, they, and, and guys like playing with them. And I think that, that to me, is something that, that makes a player really special, is when, when guys like playing with them and, and you play with that intensity. Um, and then, obviously, his skills speak for himself. He's been able to come off some of these pick and rolls and hit some threes and get down there. Um, and, yeah, it's, uh, it, it's fun to see guys like that have success. Kobe, I, yeah. certainly coaching in the G League, you kind of have to adjust on the fly as far as guys being called up, two-way guys coming down. Do you see a little bit of like this? You guys, I guess we can call it made a trade for Drew Timmy and P.J. Hall, where you're kind of two new faces here. How about adjusting those two players with, with your roster? Yeah, it's hard. You know, it's we get we get about we get a 30-minute meeting, we get a 30-minute practice, and, and but uh, the, the benefit is these guys are really good players. And I was actually talking to someone yesterday. I, I think, the college game is really doing a good job preparing them for, for the success. And, and because our guys really know how to play with each other, they know how to play with space, they know how to play the, the game that we're trying to teach them. Kobe, we're going to let you coach your team. We appreciate you spending some time with us. Kobe Carl, head coach of the Delaware Blue Coats, your champion of the NBA G League. Congratulations, brother.